was a game changer, right? And if if, if people haven't read that, I I think it should be mandatory. Like these mm-hmm. things, like there's there's a, there's this few books that I've read that are like, how come no everybody doesn't right. know this? Like everybody <laughs> should know this. Right now, I got my feet on a grounding mat, and I have the blue light blockers on, and and all these things are a little bit more scientific. But um, there's a lot of different things that. Uh, what about you? What What are the ones you you like off the top of your head to biohack your way to? You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. No. Off the top of my head, I agree with you 100% about the sleep. So that's one that I really started diving into the science this summer, and especially the book Why We Sleep by Dr. Matthew Walker. Unbelievable. Was a game changer, right? And if if, if people haven't read that, I. I I think it should be mandatory. Like these mm-hmm. things, like there's, there's, a, there's this few books that I've read that are like, how come no, everybody right. know this? Like everybody <laughs> should know this. So if you don't, if you haven't read why we sleep by uh, what's the name again, Matthew Walker, Matthew Walker, you 100%, you have to go. You, you, it's, it should be mandatory in schools. In my opinion, there's another one, but it'd be a little bit more controversial nowadays to me is sacred cow is mm-hmm. it should be mandatory lecture for everybody. And, and mm-hmm. it's really educating yourself on all these different topics, whether they're controversial or not, read up on the information yourself and make a critical analysis of really what's going on. And uh, by reading up and researching, you know, unbiased stuff, you're going to find the truth in that. And, and nutrition, if we want to go that route, that's super controversial nowadays. But honestly, right. I, I don't believe it should be. We should have a conversation about all these things. And even things that seem to be obvious for some are not for others. So it's got to be a conversation. For me, nutrition has been a big cha- game changer in my life and my family's life. My father, who's had some some health issues in the past and all that, it's all resolved. And it doesn't really work out. So we can't say it was exercise, you know, nutrition mm-hmm. really, really dialed it in for him and, and all millions of people around the world. So for me, sleep and, and, you know, just doing low level exercise, you don't have to kill yourself in workouts. You honestly don't have to little bit at a time, little bit at a time, good stretching regimen. And, uh, you eat right. You eat, you eat clean. You eat what we've been eating for millions of years. And, you're going to be fine. You know, you're going to feel good. 